So now we want to give Niblenosh a review. This is nibble and nosh. You have three choices when you're picking a box. The first is the, called the light box. It comes with four tree options and is a tenner, all in, delivery included. Second is the luxury box, which has eight tree options, one toy, one surprise, and poo bags. This comes in at 19.95, 20 quidish, delivery included, but they also give 50p of each box that you receive to charity, which I think is a nice touch. The last box is called the family box, and is obviously if you've got more than one dog, 37.95. Includes delivery and is perfect for those with more pets. So this is the range of treats that they do. There is a large range of dried treats that they do, all 100% natural ingredients, varying from beef and duck to salmon and chicken. On the website it tells you how many treats are roughly in each bag and how long each treat is and if they can be cut up into smaller treats for smaller dogs an idea on what is in the treats and how they can benefit your dog for example vitamins minerals and how they help aid in the digestive system immune system coat so all of the treats are 100% natural ingredients filled with choice cuts wheat free highly digestible and low in calories all sounds good so far uh, the ingredients for this particular treat, the divine chicken and liver fillets, we have 78.5% chicken, 10% chicken livers, then you've got 5% starch, and then the rest of it is what keeps it bendy. So those are really good percentages. Do they taste good? That's what you're interested in. If we can get into them. So I'm just looking at the rest of the treats and in the back of them, in the ingredients, you have at least 70% plus of chicken or beef or sweet potato, duck, chicken liver, before they start adding in the stuff that they need to to preserve the treat. So that is really good. Salmon. 65.5 then it's fish at 20 so again that's 85 percent fish no really good i'm giving these ones a five stars the ingredients in these i'm very pleased with the toy i'm not sure it's going to last too long especially if both of them get an ear or something and we have had it a couple of days and it was meant to bark it now does not but I'm actually quite pleased it doesn't end because it was really quite annoying. Um, so yes, all round, a thumbs up. Five stars for Nibble and Nosh. Well done, guys. Don't forget to subscribe for me. I'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys.